Yeah, good to see you back, Brins. What did you make of it out there today? Yeah, it's a difficult one today. From you know, in the first half, I think you know we didn't quite get going as as we planned, and um, you know it's breaking down a lot. And when it was breaking down, they were able to counter us. So that was quite frustrating in the first half. And you know we spoke about that. And the second half, it was a case of when controlling the ball, trying to make something happen. And you know that's the most important thing when we get into the final third. We need to get shots off and, and, and take our chances. It all seemed to get quite stagnant at times when it did get into the final third. Is that fair? And if so, why do you think that was the case? Yeah, I think you know it, we, we spoke about it at half time in terms of trying to trying to get on the ball and, uh, and cause them problems, and, and we didn't do that enough in the first half. And again, second half we started really well, um, controlled it, and started to cause them problems and. And then, like you say, it's, it got a little bit stagnant. And um, yeah, again, after the game, we look at it and it's a disappointing result because we, we want to win them. Yeah, it's, it's difficult to say because there's seven games left still, so it's not must win. But at this stage of the season, to these matches against a team like Altrincham, who have not won a game for a while and got beaten in the last four, do they feel like must win games? Absolutely. Every single game is a, is a must win. Um, you know, for us as, as Notts County, um, that's that's the objective. Uh, we expect nothing less. So again, it's a disappointing result. Uh, we want to come here and, and and win. Obviously, we we dominated in in large spells, but at the end of the day, we need to get it in the back of the net. With all that said, then why do you think it was so kind of I don't know, almost slow towards the end? There wasn't. It didn't feel like there was the urgency out there to go and try and get a winner. Yeah. I, again, it, like you say, it's. it's taking chances and trying to make something happen when we get into the final third. It's all right having the possession and, and dominating, but when we, we get into the final third, we need to come alive and, um, and you know, take a chance, um, whether it's taking someone on or, or just taking a, taking a shot. That makes all the difference and we, we didn't do that enough today. For you, first time back out there since the 23rd of January, uh, how did that feel? Tiring, to <laughs> say the least, tiring. Um, yeah, it, it's always a difficult the first game is always really, really difficult, especially when you play 90. I wasn't expecting to play 90 today, um, but you know I'm, I'm, I'm really happy to to be back. It's been a long, long, I think maybe nearly three months. Um, you know, really frustrating to to miss miss the games, and uh, obviously the objective is, is getting playoffs. I'm, I'm happy to be back. I just want to focus on getting this team back into the playoffs and, and doing what we, we set out at the start of the season. How difficult has it been to have to sit and watch from the sidelines as you've dropped down the league a little bit? Painful. I'll be honest, it's been really frustrating for me personally. I, I don't want to sit on the sidelines and, and watch. I always want to want to help the team as much as I possibly can. Um, you know, it, it's just the case of getting myself back to full fitness and obviously playing that first 90 is always really difficult and and uh, I'll be feeling it most definitely tomorrow I'm feeling it already but um, you know it's just a case of now getting my head down getting my fitness back to full sharpness and um, listen at the end of the day my main objective is, is getting this club promotion I expect nothing less so um, that's that's still the plan and that's what I'm going to push as well as the club the players the staff we're going to push for that pretty much gone Saturday, Tuesday, Saturday, Tuesday throughout the entire time that you have been out. Um, <laughs> there are still plenty of Saturday, Tuesdays to go between now and the end of the season. Are you confident you'll be able to you know, shake that injury off and that's in your rearview mirror now and you'll be good to go and, and be involved in all of those games? Yeah, of course. I mean, uh, I spoke with the physios um, about the issue that I had um, and, you know, I still feel it at times. Um, but for me, we, we always said, listen, at the end of the day, uh, I want to be back in, in contention to help the team get playoffs. Um, obviously, it's been a, a, a rocky spell for us. It's been difficult, and you know, if anything, it's more important than ever that um, I get myself back to help the team as, as much as we possibly can do. How determined is the group to make the playoffs? 110 percent. It's an absolute must. Um, it, it's very important to us, the players. You know, we, we we've been frustrated with ourselves, and when you go through that rocky spell, and it happens a lot in football, um, you go through them ups and downs um, where things are just not going your way. But at the end of the day, we have to be optimistic, we have to be positive because if we're not, it doesn't solve it. The most important thing is that we, we look to solve the problem, we look to be brave, courageous. Um, and like I say, when it comes to being on the pitch, backing each other, which we, we do 100% and we, we go out giving our absolute all. And there's no doubt that um, we'll continue to do that and, and things will turn.